Okay. All right, guys. Uh, I'm standing here in Target uh, tonight on my way back. And uh, here's some of the Master of the Universe stuff that came in tonight. I'll flip around in just a minute. Where's it at? Anyways, um, here, let me flip it. How do you flip it? How do you... There we go. There we go. How about that, guys? There's your Masters of the Universe. Which one's better? Here. How's that, guys? What do you think of that artwork? Looks pretty sick, huh? Here's the cat litter, Come on. That castle looks sick. You guys don't know how many times I'm trying to build uh, Castle Grayskull on uh, Fortnite Creative. It is, the skull is the hardest thing to build. Cringer looks pretty dope too. It's pretty cool. And then, let's see, come down here. Oh, let me go back up. I apologize. Hang on, guys. Get my videos better. I have this one already. She's pretty cool. I like the figure. Sorry for the glare, for the lights. Moss Man and uh, He Man, the only ones I need next. Try to cut that glare out. Yep. And then the one behind it's another uh, evil in. So I won't spend a lot of time on that one. So I'll put these back. Anyways, there's that. So yeah, they look pretty cool. They're pretty sturdy, pretty, pretty sturdy figures too. Um, I have two of the four of the first wave, and uh, I was actually impressed with the quality and the the durability of the figures. So um, there, I would I would recommend them if if you in a master of the universe. So. And then moving down here, I'll do this. That set's pretty cool. It's kind of where I had, um, <clears throat> adopted some parts from, and uh, for my uh, my uh, Skelly God that I did the modifications on. And uh, it's a nice set. Um, anyway, it's cool. But uh, we got a lot of those. And then this is the set. I'm gonna put it up higher so it's easier to to look at I think this is the set that I'm actually going to try to save up for let's see so I'm kind of kneeling so it's a little hard but uh, yeah that's a set that I'm looking for forward to getting that is so flip around through all the extras it's pretty sick okay yeah, just a minute uh, What's this? No questions. Invite. Oh, okay. Cool. So, anyways, it's pretty cool. Got all those solid sword, and extra hand. It's pretty cool. I think it's definitely worth the price tag. I'll get a panor on a panoramic view or horizontal view for Battle Cat. A little better here and then uh, I'm going to zoom down to the price tag here because the diorama and everything that you get it's kind of up there but um, I, I think it's a fair price if you're a collector and uh, these are the kind of things that you want to add to it I definitely recommend it so um, anyways uh, let's see what else I can show off but uh, let's take another look at that uh, battle cat I'm digging on it. I definitely will be getting this one too when I come into some funds. Hopefully, um, bank robbery is not out of the question, but uh, that was a joke. So, anyways, um, um, yeah, definitely, definitely add that one to my collection. I'm really liking the artwork too. So, and then uh, everything else. Oh. Always liked the Jurassic Park vehicles, just for nostalgic reasons, and the movie. That guy deserved his medicine. I like the sets, they're pretty cool. Glad they're doing that. I'm going to change the angle for you here. Sorry for the jumpiness. I want to get that one, just for the Joes, as funny as that sounds. And then do another. 
definitely want that one. He looks mean. I like it. I won't, they, they make sounds, but I won't push it because they're kind of obnoxious when they echo in the aisles. So, anyways, uh, go to your own target and get the sound effects, okay? <laughs> anyways, you get what I'm saying. So, but yeah, it's a really neat figure. I've always wanted the dino figures, but never been able to afford it. So, whenever I can, I'm definitely adding dinosaurs to my collection. And only the Jurassic Park variety because I feel that they have the better quality of all the other ones that are out there. So, bear with me, I'm standing up. Um, Let's see, I'm gonna come down here a little more. Hang on before I get up. So I do those. Um, I I don't know, I have to flip this over, but I, I thought this was kind of just like a hand puppet. But uh, we'll flip it over here in just a minute and see more of it. And uh, go from there. Hang on, guys. I'm gonna get my hands out of the way. Hmm. No, I guess it's complete. I don't see anything that dictates it's a hand puppet, so I guess it's just in two pieces. You put it together when you get it out of the box. Oops, sorry. Sorry about that, guys. Kind of sloppy on the camera there. Yeah, I like that too, but might save that one for last. And then, one of mine and probably a lot of people's all-time favorite. Sorry for the hairy arm there. Uh, good old T-Rex. Got that trap cage before they put him on the boat. I like it. But what I also want to get might be out of scale, but I think they did that just to mix up variety. This guy right here is the same size as the the white one. I can't remember the name of it at the moment, but uh, I kind of want to get this big bad boy too, just because he's got more colors than white. And uh, I'll flip him around. I'm gonna get a face view. Hang on. I'm gonna give you guys a different angle. Take a look. So you got battle scars and everything. Pretty nicely done. So, anyways, yeah. Hey, how you doing? How you doing there, young lady? Thank you for joining. I appreciate it. Just kind of drooling over the dinosaurs right now. Kind of one of my, uh, kind of one of my coveted collections that I've never been able to afford to get. So, we'll kind of just pan the aisles. And thank you for joining, by the way. Just uh, some of the dinosaurs I want to save up for. And, uh, sorry for the wonky camera feed. I'll get better. And, uh, here's Wally. Now oh, he's pretty cool. Yeah, the T-Rex, that one, the T-Rex here, let me pan down for you. They actually have the T-Rex, the T-Rex in the smaller scale this time around. And uh, so this guy, this one, the cartoon, I'm not gonna pronounce it. I'll let you guys pronounce it. But uh, you are right, he's huge. Whatever, whatever breed of dinosaur he is, he's a monster. Yeah, so I agree with you there. So, anyways, I was looking to see if they had any Joes in, and since you joined, I was looking for, I, I wasn't disappointed. I came in the night, and I wasn't disappointed. They got the new uh, Masterverse Battle Cat in, which is amazing. Uh, hang on, get my big banana hands out of the way. Look at that. He's huge, right? I agree. I love it. And then, I don't know if you've seen any of the Masterverse figures or not, but there's Evil Lynn. They're pretty sturdy, pretty sturdy uh, figures, like I was saying earlier. And uh, I got this one. And when I get some more money, I need to get Moss Man. Yeah, the head is pretty huge, isn't he? Oops, sorry for the glare. Uh, I'm trying to match the glare with the face. I hope that's a fairly good angle. But he's a pretty good, uh, cool figure. Again, I apologize for the glare, but watch. Put these back. I'll let you see a size comparison with that Battle Cat. Here's your five and a half inch Masters of the Universe. Next to the, 
next to that new battle cat. What do you think? He's huge. It's it's kind of a deception with the camera with exactly how big the scale he is compared to that five and a half inch uh, Skeletor. And uh, it's giant. They're huge. So, and then I was telling my, our, our buddy, um, uh, I think it was Skydro, I think it was him. Uh, I, I had that set, we got some pieces off of that one. That's pretty cool. And thank you for the compliment. This is actually my first live for toy hunting. Now, this is the set, if it stays. I'll try to get this day, sorry for the mess or the slop. That's the set I want. Yeah, I wish I could show you the other, oh, I can show you the other brother cat. Hold on, just, I just want to show you the set real quick, but look at that. You get, first we'll pan over to Battle Cat. He's huge, or the, 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 the Origins Battle Cat. And then look at all the fun stuff that you get with uh, Battle Armor He-Man. You get some little, uh, what are those little nymphs, dragons or something. And uh, I want that two-pack so bad. But it's got a $50 price tag. But look at all the goodies. And I'll pan inside the box a little bit. You get a little uh, diorama set with it. So in my opinion, it's worth the $50 price tag, you know. So let's go back up. Let's try this. Let's play around since you mentioned it. Let's try to do our best. Hang on, it's going to get sloppy for a minute. I apologize. Let me get this empty box out of the way. Let's do this. And, you ready? Or here, let's switch places. Again, I apologize for the slop. The sloppy camera work. Hang on. Here, this just makes more sense. How about you guys take a look at that? What do you think of that scale? That's intense, right? How cool is that? But I want them both because, like I said earlier, I love that set. That set is so clean, man. And uh, yeah, it's clean. But it's, that's not gonna detour me from getting this one too, you know? So anyways, but uh, yeah, I'm pretty excited, but you gotta have the funds before you can play, you know? So again, sorry for the sloppy camera work here. Just putting everything back because I know how it is, how hard it is, uh, how hard it is to work retail and have, you know, kids come in and thrash your department when you work all day, try to keep it organized, you know, so, anyways, oh, thank you very much, I appreciate it, um, I really appreciate it, oh, here's another set that I've been kind of eyeballing, whether I get it or not is another story, but, uh, I'll do my best, but try not to make too much of a mess for her, look, uh, check out this set, guys. I had to make room for it. I know what you got back there. <laughs> exactly. Check it out. Look at that. The, the the lever set for Hoth. I already have that Leia, so that's the only thing that's keeping me from buying this. But I want that Han Solo. Um, it looks great. And this is what I've got back there. This is this is what I got back there. That's the answer to the question. <laughs> Anyways, so it's a great looking set. I like it. And. Uh, um, I might actually get that in the future and sell my single single Leia because that's probably got that uh, That new software Hasbro has been using for uh, Star Wars black series the I'm not going to get it right guys, but I think you know what I mean um, The ID uh, Capture or whatever or true capture uh, software for their faces and stuff like I said I know I'm going to butcher I'm going to get it right, but anyways, let's see GBH proton blaster. That's wrong. Okay, well, I didn't mess it up too bad. I want to leave it faced so it actually looks like it can sell. Um, everybody's in love with this guy. I'll try not to go too fast. And uh, oh, the Yodas. Oh, hey, I was talking to a couple of the guys. Get this out of the way. Okay. Okay. A lot of the guys that I've seen on the. Um, Customs are turning this into a Cobra vehicle for their troopers two things um, They beat me to it number one and number two I want to buy two of them one for my Cobra troopers and a second one so I can make my own Punisher van and uh, That would be my plan for and reason for having two of them 
so it's pretty sick and then uh, right right and then I've been watching the wrestlers not so much that I collect them but more of the deluxe ones that have the the more or excuse me the higher quality articulation and stuff and it's exactly it's gonna sound funny it's like how can I turn him into a GI Joe or how is this guy going to be a custom for something else? <laughs> you know, so I'm not, it's horrible to say, but I wouldn't buy a wrestler for the wrestler. I'd buy him for a, a mod or a customization. So, trying to be open-minded on that. Uh, I'll show you something. Most people don't want this because they make Adam a little too fruity. I know, right? I took this out, uh, pan down. Okay, they have like, or they did have like 15 to 20 of these on the shelf. I don't know how many they got now, but it's like a $30, $40 set, right? They had it marked down to 15 for both. And uh, that's a good deal, but I don't, I don't want the character. So that guy right there, nah, it's good. I can't even figure out what I can mod him for. So sorry for the sloppy on the camera. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> that or just buy him a dress and finish the finish his attire, right? You know, it's hilarious. So, oh, off subject, but not really. Still in the toy. I'll check out this car. 57 Chevy. Oh, my God. Look at that. Look how clean that is. I like it for the car. I'd buy it just for the car. That's a nice car, man. Yeah, I agree with you. That is so clean. Yeah, definitely. So, let's see, I'm gonna flip around the aisle. Oh, no I'm not, I stand corrected. They have the minis too, I meant to tell you guys. They have all of the minis. Here. Oh, get my banana hands out of the way so you can actually see the figure. That's cool. Oops. I'll make one reach. Come on. They was well, packed, so they're going fast, guys. I'll try to go not too slow, but not too fast, so you can actually enjoy the view. The hammer review. Help me out with that one, Cammy. Almost bought a figure. Had a Tila head. Nice. Yeah. Hey, always, always custom minded. You know, nothing wrong with that. I'm gonna. I got work injuries, so I'm kind of a little wobbly when I go down to get closer to the figures here. And uh, here, I'll try to do that. The minis are kind of cool. Yeah, Cammy, uh, whatever it takes to get that custom built and modified, absolutely. You know? The clawful looks cool. I like it. I don't know if he's the same one or not. Oh yeah, Merman. Figurehead wants a Tila to smash. <laughs> I bet he does. I bet he does. That Merman's pretty cool. And then, oh, that's not a skunk or is it? Oh, here's a. Oh, that uh, the first one we looked at. He does hammer reveals. Oh, okay. Now I'm with you. See, I didn't know that. I've not watched uh, uh, Figurehead enough on his channels to know all the little other things that he does. There's your man at arms. Oh, here's the He-Man. Sorry, you've already seen that one. I won't I won't stay there too long. Here's the anti-Eternia He-Man. I'll bring these up, makes it easier. There's the Zodak. He looks cool. I like him. Okay. I actually want one of these right here. Hang on, leave him there so you don't get all the bump. Hammer, view, hammer reviews, that's hilarious, I love it. I'm gonna have to tune in when he's actually doing one of those. It's hilarious, I like the Orco, the mini Orco, it's sick. Sorry for the the wobble here. Let me get you an actual, I think, oh, we already got the He-Man. Well, I think that's it for the minis that I can remember. Oh, there was a Tila and a, uh, there was a Tila and, um, oh, there she is. There's the evil, there's an evil in. I'll get her in a minute. There's a Tila. Or sorry, not Tila. Excuse me. Evil Lynn. You can tell now, now I'm Tila minded. I'm not a pervert. You're a pervert. Get out of here. Anyways, here, I'll leave it up there until I can find Tila. Anyways, 
Nope, I don't see her. I think they got her bought out. I only saw one or two of her today anyway. Still got it? Sorry. Nope, I think they got her. I think they got her today. Um, but here, let me just do this. This will help with all the other ones too. They got a poster with the other ones that are coming. So, anyways, I like it. Sorry, time to stand up. I'm too heavy for these old man ankles. Oh, lordy. Alrighty, so we'll pan around. I don't know if any of you guys are in the Hot Wheels or not, but we'll kind of do a quick swipe on those. Nothing serious, you know. Anyways, yeah. Yep, alrighty. Okay, give me a minute, we're gonna wrap around the aisle here. Sorry, oh. And we'll do this. They got some cool Batmans over here. There we go. What we're looking for right now, Toy God. Go ahead and grab me a Snickers. Yeah, you got it, brother. You know it. I got my food card with me. I'll get you a Snickers. <laughs> Hey, thanks for joining, buddy. Appreciate it. And uh, Crunchy Cheeto Creations. Good. That's good, Crunchy Cheetos. That's awesome. I've not seen her first one, but I'd like to, or whatever, her other one. This is my first one. So, sorry for the sloppy view. They got some more Transformers out. I'm not a fan. I mean, I love Transformers, don't get me wrong. Just not this particular style. Me, personally. Or is that Galvatron? I thought it was Shockwave, but it's not. Put him back. And then, who's this? Ultramagnus? Here, I'll do this. Anyways. So, oh, what I was looking for um, is there's a set on the other side, the Master of the Universe. It's a really cool collection. And, uh, Anyways, oh, so he's all white, then you had the armor, and he's mixed. That's pretty cool. I kind of like, I like the concept of that character, but I don't know. We'll have to, hey, hey, uh, uh, Toy God, let's let's send one over to uh, Cobra Cobra Viper so he can uh, put his wash work on it again. <laughs> just just to be a stinker, huh? Right. And that's okay, Toy God. You don't have to just. You don't have to know anything about them. It's totally fine. Hey, Toy Cartel. Good. Thanks for joining, man. Appreciate it. I'll wave at you when my phone agrees to let me. So, um, anyways. Sorry I missed anybody. Uh, love you too, buddy. Uh, sorry I missed any waving at anybody when you came in. Apologize for that. Um, it was, there he is. One wave down. Crunchy Cheetos. I've got to wave out to you. Yeah, sometimes my phone doesn't let me wave at you guys, so I apologize for that and anyone that I missed. So, uh, Cammy, I don't even know if I waved to you, so I apologize. You were the first one in, so if I didn't wave to you, I apologize. Here you go. Yeah, now my phone lets me. Okay, cool. Let me scroll down and catch up with you guys. I'm in sideways. What the... Yeah, so Crunchy Cheeto, send send me that link for uh, Cammy's Target. Yeah, for so I can watch it, man. You know, like I said, this is my first one, and I know it's going to be sloppy because I'm sore, I'm hot, I'm sweaty, and I've not done it before. So, anyways, uh, I'd love to watch hers. And uh, the Hunter, hey Hunter, thanks for joining, man. Appreciate it. Oops, my phone's acting wonky. So if I back out too far. I'll just go live again, so Hunter, it's not letting me wave at you, but I mean to. My phone's just being wonky right now, so I'm sorry. Anyway, so no worries, no worries. Cool. Phone's being crazy. So basically Master of the Universe, and basically I'm just kind of uh watching the inventory on the uh on the Joes. We haven't got any Joes yet, but we're getting damn near everything else. That Cabal is pretty sick. I'm not a big Mortal Kombat fan for the figures, but I love the movies and the games. Not that I play them, but they're still cool to watch. Anyways, um, they're all... I'd scroll down, but as you can see, I won't waste a lot of time, but they're all Cabal, so we're not really missing anything. I will take you over to the, the neck... The, 
is it the I'm not going to say it right because is it Nezco or no there's NECA and then the other one so I'll take it to the NECA area later uh, they're thinning out on the Marvel Legends that Thor is pretty cool I'm just, I just don't want it from my collection you know oh yeah the uh, Cabal's pretty cool yeah that was the buddy Cabal uh, Toy God yeah NECA exactly um That cabal goes hard. Yeah, it's pretty tight, man. He, he, everything about his fists are bloody, his or his fist gauntlets or whatever, on top of his hand are bloody. So, yeah, Nuka, Neca, and Mezco. Thank you. Like I said, it's hot. My brain's cooked. I think I sat in the sun for like two and a half, three hours today, trying not to pass out. Oh yeah, I know it's good. There's some in this line from the the, the Infinity Saga. There are some figures that I actually want. Oh, they're only going to show him and Thor. There, try to cut the glare down as much as possible. So, put it down enough just to flip it. Come on, Batman. So, sorry for the flop camera angles, guys. Up to Daisy. Yeah, 26 49 Yeah, the price is going up because we don't have an oil a pipeline in America no more. Because Numb Nuts shut it down and now we have to import it overseas again. There's a bright box for you, huh? Oh, look, guys, check it out. There's a custom made uh, Slurpee cup here. I wonder how much that's going to cost somebody. All right, yeah, nothing good there. Quick panel. Nothing good there. Kind of like, kind of like that. That looks pretty cool. Oops, sorry, that looks pretty cool. Yeah, I know, the tour. Um, all right, guys, I don't really see anything. I mean, I might do a quick run by on the Masters of the Universe Island again so I can show uh, the other folks that have joined us. Um, all the, st the stuff that I'm getting. Oh, real quick, hey, Toy God, and everybody in chat, check this out. They've got the, uh, they've got the, the Slambulance that you can then turn into a SWAT team truck for the Cobra Troopers. Like I think I was telling uh, Skydro or somebody, I was telling someone I was going to turn it into a uh, Punisher van too, so I want to get two of those, two. Anyways, and then check this guy's out. You ready? This is my battle plan. I know it looks really, really wonky. Check out the, now see here at uh, Target, they're 20 bucks, but you go to Amazon, they're 15. Okay, you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking Dreadnought, Mer Dreadnought Cycles every one of them and then use a fancier bike for Zartan that'd be my battle plan anyway so baby Yoda says to tell everybody hi <laughs> all of his brothers too uh, sorry for the post okay so what I was showing uh, Cammy when she came in was I was showing her the Master of the Universe Revelations okay and that first one's Evil Inn, as you can read. And then, try not to spend a lot of time on it so we can get to NECA. And then, Moss Man there. So, I'm trying not to spend a lot of time because Cammy's already seen this twice, I think. And then, you ready? Look at that beast. Look at that beast. I'll try to do my best. Sorry for the slop camera. Um, let me trade places. It's going to be kind of ghostly for a minute. I want to do a comparison, guys, for you. Sorry for the mess. Ready? First, this is what I'm looking for, Toy God. That's the set I'm looking for. Look at that. You get that diorama set in there, full length of the box. That's about 16, 18 inches. The Battle Cat, Battle Scars, and all the extras. Right? Yeah, that's what I want to get. That's what I'm saving up for. It's a $50 price tag, but I think it's worth it. Look, uh, if we get closer, sorry for the foggy, the blur. He's got Battle Scars on his legs, his arms face that's a full sword not a half sword that's full got those goodies now you ready here comes the side by side look at that that's intense guys isn't that cool I love it man that is so awesome 
Now let me quit making a mess in the toy department, put everything back, and we'll head over to the NECA section. Oh, sorry for the mess. Here, drool a little bit on that one while I fix my mess here. Yeah, so I'm getting both. So, for the Massiverse figures, I need to get, I was selling uh, Kami, I need to get uh, He-Man and Mossman, and I'll be done for the first wave. So here, let's kind of go take a little airplane ride. And if none of you have seen, I don't know if any of you have seen the, uh, uh, have any of you seen the Skelly God yet? Hold on. Let's see if they moved him. Oh, wait, they might have moved him, so hold on, guys, I'm sorry. Oh, there he is, I see him. I didn't go down far enough. Damn it, kids, I told you to wait in the car. Okay, guys, let me just bring him to me. Get my big banana hand out of the way. Uh, there we go. That skeleton god is sick. He's supposed to be eight inches because all the other ones are seven. He's dope. I like him. I have him. He's the mod that I did. I have pics on in, on my Instagram page. I liked him. Oh yeah, what I didn't show you guys is where I put his original head at. You saw where I put the Skeletor head, but you didn't see the original one. Get back in the car. I'll call your mother. Anyways, we're going to NECA right now. Oh no way! Did you, Cammy? That's so cool. We're gonna see a lot of we're gonna see a lot of Funkos now here in a minute. I'm going the right way. That's okay. Pictures are good. Yeah, we're hunting, buddy. Any of you guys like the uh, Dune, the movie Dune? They got like four or five of their figures. I'll try to scrounge. But they're buried, so they're kind of wonkified down in this hole here. Sorry for my banana hands. You got a lot of the, is that the same one? I think it's the same one, same guy. Duncan, yeah. Duncan of Idaho. Duncan, Duncan says he's the hoe. That makes me the pimp. Wait, what? Yeah, so there's that one. Oh, let me get comfortable, guys. Got a lot of weight to balance. Hold on. You gotta dig him out. Yeah. I got him. Got him. And uh, kind of put him back. I, You know, because I got a lot of retail experience, like 10, 20 years worth, I catch myself uh, 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 facing the shelves, organizing, putting things in order. It's like, God, I'm not getting paid for this, but I'm having fun, so I don't complain too much. Who's that? Got him already. Those are the same. Those are the same. Sorry for the inter, inter, what is it called? All the interruptions. Are you ready? Here's the big dude. Here's the big dude. That guy fills his box. He's a beast. Of course, they use my my sexy body for the mold for that, you know. So I'm kind of famous. But um, let's see. They got two of them, which I didn't know. Get you guys looking at something. That uh, that Seppin Wolf looks sick, but he's the movie version, I'm sure. Yeah, pretty big. I saw a the, the okay guys check this out. I um I saw a uh, oh excuse me I'm trying to remember his name. Um the the major one of the major villains in DC. Um not Apocalypse the other one. Even though Apocalypse is Marvel too. Um, um help me out here guys. He's one of the bigger villains for Superman. Uh, damn, let me look. Not in the back. Um, Dark Seed. It's how, help you guys help me pronounce it. Dark side, dark seed, and uh, the new dark side. He looks sick. I don't usually buy villains unless they're cool. I'll probably end up buying dark side, dark seed. How do you pronounce it? You know. And uh, um, I know. I think it was. 
um, figurehead. I think him and another guy are big. Was it Warhammer that they're into? I can't remember. He had one of these. He had the, the blue one, I think. Here's the red one. Where'd the other ones go? Oh, they moved. Duh. Back to the future. There's that one. That one looks pretty cool. Oh, Winnie the Pooh. Okay, I'm trying. To, I'm here because I want to show you guys a couple things. Um, Back to the Future, Wonder Woman. I'll try to let you guys look at something while I'm digging. So, um, hey, uh, was it? What are they called? I forget the name of the toy company, even though I'm looking right at the brand. Anyways, this toy company right here, they tipped the hat off to Stan Lee and they made a figure. Oh, right here. That toy company made a figure. Um, I can't remember their name. Even though it's on the box, I can't find it to pronounce it. A lot of the horror figures, sorry for the fast flash. All that good stuff. Here's some stands. You guys, check your NECA selection for stands. Let's see. Oh wow, shit. I did, I'm sorry guys, I didn't realize I was so far up, my bad. I think I was checking for waves. Um, well yeah, I think it was uh, Figurehead that was really into the Warhammers, I think he was talking to. Oh, you got that Slambulance already, uh, Cheeto? Nice. What are you going to do with it? Toy guy, bad meaning. Yeah, one of those. Uh, so I'm going to tell Teddy that I think it's They do, they do. Sick. Trying to catch up with you guys here, so sorry for the, the delay. Pick it up, yeah. Yeah, I would love to get that moss band, but I'm broke, guys. I'm, I'm actually overdrawn, so my insurance took out and uh, put me in overdraw. So, yeah, I'm glad they did a bigger mass with universe scale too. Oops, sorry. Hang on. All right, so I'm gonna do this. Oh. Hey guys, I'm excited. I've always been a fan. I'm sure there's a lot of you out there that are. The Wild Stallions, man. I didn't ever knew they had a cartoon, but I would love just to have those for my collection. They look really cool. I think they're just like non-articulated vinyls. That's okay with me, man. I like them just for the nostalgia value, personally. You know? So, I'm digging on it. All right, guys. Sorry, I'm not. Sorry, I'm not keeping up. Here's a lot of the pops. Again, you're gonna see me organize them so I can look at them better. <laughs> it's it's a tick, man. I'm telling you, it's a retail tick. It never leaves your blood. It always stays in you, man. It's crazy. See how to retail if you can help it. It's a, not so much addicting. It's contagious. <laughs> yeah. If you guys want me to dig anything, I'll do my best to try to pull some out can't promise I'm still trying to catch it from the last time I fell behind on your guys' chat so so give me a minute I'm gonna flip I'll give you guys something to look at while I scroll and try to catch up okay uh, sick Skelly God is sick Cammy I didn't like the small head he had so I'll give it to my my origin Skeletor I'll take pics of him later or post him later Deathstroke. I think, yeah, I think he's a Deathstroke over there somewhere. Maybe. Dark Seed. Dark Side. Yes, thank you. Who's that, Cheeto? Who looks better that color? I'm about to have three Sentinels as remates. Nice. That's sick, Cheeto. Nice. Yeah, I just got that email today. Uh, Earlier this afternoon, Sentinels are going to be sent out at the end of September. That's sick. <laughs> Cheeto. Hey, if you if you claim your... <laughs> dude, let me know if you get away with claiming your Sentinels as dependents. That, I would love it. Left my butt off. That's hilarious. Build bunk beds. Yeah, that's hilarious. Good one, Cammy. I think I'm caught up. Elvis won. The Elvis figure? Yeah, he was down there somewhere on the middle shelf, I think. I can go back if you want me to. Mm, excuse me. Sorry, guys. So, yeah, I'm just farting around. 
Here's the top shelf. Oh, if you guys, any of you guys are Jason fans, I'll go pardon to get above that light somewhat, or as much as possible. Yes. And then, hey, that looks like my front door. I think those are my stairs. I think that's my kitchen knife. Oh shit. Sorry, mom. I'm doing live stream. I'll call you later. Anyway. <laughs> no time to warn you of the danger. Anyways, this is important. Right, 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 right. Um, my bad. Priorities, guys. Priorities. I'll get better with that camera when I. I kind of like this. I'm not going to collect it, but I just like I like the looks of it. Kind of cool. Kind of an armored Hulk, which is kind of redundant anyway because he's already armored just with the gamma radiation. So, anyways, yeah. Oh. We're not done unless I can, if I can't find what I'm actually looking for to show you guys, then we're close to be rounding up here. But uh, um, there is, hang on, this is another one. Is it identical? Oh, you guys already saw this one for the, the Dune character. Okay, just so you know, we already saw that, guys. So I won't spend a lot of time. Okay, like I said before, when I'm here, I'm usually cleaning things up. Okay. Now, um, I was telling Skydro, I think it was Skydro that I was telling, I was saying that um, uh, where were we at? I like that was one. The buzz. Okay. Hang on, guys. You ready? This is the one that I want to get for the spawns. I love, I love the, uh, the Asian, um, I don't know, it's the word motif, that's like deco, right, decorations of the architecture and all that stuff, not so much the philosophy or religion per se, but just more of this, really, you know, it's just sick, and I love it. Now, um, if I ever go to GameStop and they still have a deluxe, a deluxe Mandarin, I'll show you that one. It's like twice the size and more weapons, including the two you see here. Oops, hang on guys. Trying to catch up with you. Yeah, he is sick. Yeah. Oh, did I pronounce it wrong? Sorry. I'm tired. I'm sore. And I'm sitting here sweating like a stick of butter here. But the uh, Mandarin, yeah, he is sick though. I'll kind of get a zoom in. Hopefully it doesn't uh, decrease the quality. Let it focus. Come on. Yeah, you saw that deluxe one, Cami? You saw that big one that's like 12, 13 inches or whatever? You bought it? No way. That's sick. Are you talking about the one we're looking at now? Because look at that extra face on his armor. That is so sick. Right, Cheeto? I'm telling you, look at that chest piece. The belt. Look at the detail on the loin, the loin cloth there. That looks like raised paint or even plastic on top of that cloth. It looks like plastic glued on. Love that broadsword. You got that etched detail in there. Yeah. My battery's at 15%, guys, so we're probably going to wrap it up here pretty quick. So, yeah, let me flip it over. There's a hell of detail on the back, too. Well, maybe not, but I thought there was, but anyways. So, yeah. I think there's more detail on the deluxe box of the man, deluxe Mandarin box, so, yeah, that's pretty cool. What else? Not him, he's dopey. Anyways, guys, uh, I think that's about it for the night. I don't plan on going anywhere else. I gotta, I gotta conserve fuel, and uh, I'm tired. The heat pretty much wore me out today, just sitting in my car. You know, if I didn't burn no calories, I'll be disappointed. But nonetheless, I'm dying over here. But I tell you what, guys, this was a lot of fun. So thank you to everyone that's joined me tonight on my uh, my first live stream. And first uh, toy hunt live stream. So these are identical, but I just, that's the retail on me putting everything side by side. So now these are good too. I'm not a Witcher fan, 
but those are nicely done. Yeah, exactly. I agree. Hey, thank you very much, Cammy. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Let me flip one over. I flip the one around. Excuse me. There we go. How's that, guys? I'll get better at holding the camper. Thank you, Cheeto. I appreciate it, brother. Yeah. Pretty cool. All right, you guys. Let me just see. Figure this out. All right, everybody. <laughs> As you can see, I'm sweating like a stick of butter over here. Oh boy, kind of going to a quiet part of the store and just kind of chill out. But I uh, appreciate everyone being here tonight. And uh, cool. hey, you too, Cheeto. Thanks for dropping in, man. I appreciate it. Well, thanks everyone for joining me. You too, uh, Toy God. Cammy, I appreciate it. Which one, Mythic Legions? Which one of those? You referring to the um, the Witcher, Cammy? Hey, you have a good night too, Cheeto. Thanks for dropping by, man. I appreciate it. So. Yeah. Yeah, so. Yeah, the Witcher. Okay, yeah, I thought so. So, yeah, it, like I said, it looks cool. I mean, just because I don't want it for my collection doesn't make it any less cool of a figure, you know? So, yeah. You know, it's not for shy of not liking it. Just not for my collection is all, you know? So, anyways. All right, guys. I'm going to shut it down. And uh, you guys have a good night. Thank you for joining me. And uh, hope there will be many more to come. And I won't look like a scruffy nerf herder the next time, <laughs> the next time you see me. So, anyways, you guys take care and have a good night, okay? We'll see you later.